All right, Sophia, how are you doing? I'm so good. So happy to be here, Oscar. And what's your D23 experience been like so far? It's been so surreal. I can't stop smiling, really. I'm, I'm so happy to be here and so lucky to meet everyone. And we caught a little bit of your performance, too. What was it like performing here? It was so cool. It was my second time performing live and first time performing right into the core. And it was so cool to see everyone singing along. And it was really special. And the fans here, they're going crazy for you. What's it like when you finally get to see them all? You know, it's my first experience with fans and my first meet and greet, and it's been probably the most rewarding experience I've ever experienced. Seeing girls dressed as Evie with their blue hair and everyone knowing the lyrics to the songs, it's amazing. And let's talk a little bit about Descendants. It has been so successful. Were you expecting any of the success at all? You know, I don't think any of us could expect what's happened. I think we all hoped for the best and hoped people loved it as much as we did, but uh, we couldn't be more thankful to everyone, really. And was there any pressure going into this? You're playing the kids of these iconic characters. It kind of be like a little nerve wracking, right? There was definitely some pressure, especially it was my first movie. So for me, it was like double the pressure because I've never really acted in a film before. And to play the daughter of such an iconic character. But I think it felt more like an honor and more like we kind of turned the pressure into excitement. And we all just loved the movie so much and loved the story so much that we put our hearts and souls into it. And tell me how you told your family how you got the role, because I think I saw a little something on Instagram, right? Yeah. Well, so it was my day of finals of UCLA, and I had just finished, and I had auditioned, well, my like fifth audition was like two days prior, and I got the call saying that I got the part, and I cried my eyes off while driving to the airport to pick up my mom and sister, who were flying to LA, and I wrote on a piece of paper I got the part, and I picked them up, and they couldn't believe it, they were silent for like, 30 minutes, and after like 30 minutes of silence, my little sister said, oh my God, your face is gonna be on a lunchbox. <laughs> and it all hit us. And then I saw the lunchbox recently, which was so surreal, and we were all just so excited and so thankful. Yeah, and you're really blowing up. I hear you also send a record deal too, right? Yes, yes, I have a record deal, and I'm working on my album. I've been writing since I was a little girl and dreaming of this since I was like three. So to be able to share my music with the world is very exciting. It's amazing. I can't even imagine like how your career is going to take off after this. And Descendants 2, is that going to be something that's in the works? I hope so. I keep getting asked, and I just say that if, I hope so. Fingers crossed. I want to see where Evie's story goes, and I'm dying to tell her story again, so hopefully.